start with a square of side length y, covering an area of y squared. Then remove a square from the lower left corner with side length z, so that the resulting area is y squared minus z squared. We can cut the resulting gnomon in half along the diagonal, creating two trapezoids. Move one of the trapezoids down, rotate it, and then flip it to connect it to the other trapezoid, resulting in a rectangle. The rectangle has side length y minus z, and the other side length is y plus z. Therefore, the original area of y squared minus z squared is the same as the product of y plus z and y minus z. This formula is known as the difference of squares formula. We can plug in x plus a over 2 for y and a over 2 for z so that y plus z is x plus a and y minus z is x. Then the resulting equation becomes x plus a over 2 squared minus a over 2 squared is equal to x plus a times x. But the latter quantity is just x squared plus a times x. Therefore, the quantity x plus a over 2 squared minus a over 2 squared is equal to x squared plus ax. This equation is known as completing the square, and therefore we have used the difference of squares formula to complete the square.